Welcome to the Game Audio Resource Wise and Unreal Audio Implementation Guide Series. In this guide, we implement a looping light water splashes audio asset to be tagged as a 3D emitter around the water edge of our map island. The process this guide highlights can then be used to place as many different 3D emitters for other audio content types into the world map. First, we set up the needed Wise and Unreal data for the content to be tagged into the world map. Navigate to the ActorMixer Hierarchy, Default Work Unit, SFX, Environment Work Unit. Right click, then select New Child, ActorMixer. Name it EMV underscore water underscore splash. Select the ActorMixer. Then in the Properties Editor, General Settings tab, Output Bus. Drag the Environment Audio Bus onto the box called Master Audio Bus. Right click the actor mixer, then select new child random container. Name it EMV underscore water underscore splash underscore loop. Drag in two continually looping light water splashing movement audio assets into the random container. Place them under the file importer destination path, SFX, environment, then new folder called water underscore splash. Select the looping audio assets individually. Then in the Properties Editor General Settings tab, tick the loop box for each audio asset. In the Share Sets tab, we will add a basic 3D small attenuation. Navigate to the Share Sets tab. Right click the Environment Work Unit. Then select New Child Attenuation. Name it ATT underscore EMV underscore small. Open the attenuation, then add the following changes. Change the max distance to 1500. In the graph, add a point marker to the red line, then move the marker to the following coordinates. X equals 500 and Y equals zero. Right click the red line after the 500 point marker. Then select the logarithmic base three curve. Then close the attenuation window. Navigate back to the audio tab, then select the water underscore splash random container. In the positionings tab, add the following changes. Tick override parent, then under listener relative routing, 3D spartalization, change the drop down menu to position and orientation. Under attenuation, assign the new attenuation ATT underscore EMV underscore small. Right click the random container. Then select New Event, then Play. Select the Event Editor Play Action Line. Then change the Fade Time value to 0.3. Navigate to the Events tab and locate the event. Rename the event to SFX underscore EMV underscore water underscore splash underscore loop underscore start. In the Events tab, right click the Environment Work Unit, then select New Child Virtual Folder. Name it EMV underscore water underscore splash. Drag the event into the new virtual folder. Then copy and paste the new event in the same folder location. Select the new copied event. Rename it to be SFX underscore EMV underscore water underscore splash underscore loop underscore stop. Then in the event editor list, change the play action to stop then stop action type. Change the wise layout soundbanks. Generate the SB underscore environment soundbank. Then save the wise project updates. Next, we add the new wise content to Unreal. In the content browser, content audio wise events environment folder, right click, then select new folder. Name it EMV underscore water underscore splash. Open the wise picker. Then drag the SFX underscore EMV underscore water underscore splash underscore loop underscore start and stop events into the new EMV underscore water underscore splash folder. Select both the events. Then right click and select edit. In the drop down menu, select the SB underscore environment sound bank. Close the window and save the event updates. In the Unreal toolbar build option, Select Generate Soundbanks. 
Then in the sound bank window, select the SB underscore environment sound bank and leave all platforms selected. Click the generate UI button. After a few seconds, a pop-up window is displayed in the lower right of your screen. Choose to import the new sound bank updates. This step will outline how to place an emitter into a default test map. So you will hear water splash loop content triggering in 3D world positions. Using the attenuation, the sound will fade in and out as you move closer and away from the emitter position. Load up the new test map we have created or the map you are working with. Drag the event sfx underscore emv underscore water underscore splash underscore loop underscore start into the map. Then move the emitter to a place on the map where you would like to hear the water splash loop. For example, on an area of water. Then in the details tab, add the following changes. Under AK component, occlusion refresh interval, change the value to 0.0. .0. This turns off the audio occlusion. Under spatial audio, untick the use spatial audio tick box. Under AK ambient sound, Tick the auto post tick box. This enables the event to be loaded when the map loads. In the world outliner hierarchy, right click the audio folder, then select create subfolder. Name it emv underscore water underscore splash. Move the event into the new folder. Then save the map updates. Now we can test the updates in game. Connect wires to the Unreal Editor. Change the wires layout profiler. Click play in the Unreal toolbar to load the map. Move the player character to the position of the new 3D water underscore splash emitter. You should now hear the associated audio assets implemented. If you turn the player character so that the emitter is to the left of the camera, you should now hear the sounds coming mainly from the left speaker. This ensures 3D positioning is working correctly. Make any attenuation or balancing updates you wish to make, then save the WISE project updates. Disconnect WISE from Unreal, then generate the WISE sound banks, then generate the Unreal sound banks. Now you can implement 3D emitters. You can populate the map with as many emitters as you wish. Obviously, the more emitters you place, the more memory is used. So be consistent with how you place emitters on the map. For further information about implementing different types of environment tech, Please see the associated written guide of this chapter on our website.